All information about the disease refer to the website 247naturalhealthtricks.com. Best treatment for kidney stones at the hospital. Small stones with mild symptoms. Most small kidney stones will not require invasive treatment. You can easily pass a kidney stone by. Drink water. Drinking 1.5 to 2.5 liters daily can help flush out your urinary system. Unless your doctor tells you otherwise, drink enough fluids, mainly water, to make clear or nearly clear urine. Analgesic. Going through a small stone can cause some discomfort. For mild pain relief, your doctor may recommend pain medication such as ibuprofen, Advil, Motrin IB, others, acetaminophen, Tylenol, others, or naproxen sodium, Aleve. Internally medical treatment. Your doctor may give you a medicine to help overcome kidney stones. This medicine, called an alpha blocker, relaxes the muscles in your ureter. It will help you pass kidney stones faster and with less pain. Large stones and cause serious symptoms. Kidney stones that can't be treated with conservative measures. They're too large to pass on their own. Because they cause bleeding. Kidney damage or urinary tract infections. Need more extensive treatment. Procedures may include. Using sound waves to break up stones. For certain kidney stones, depending on the size and location. Your doctor may recommend a procedure called extracellular shockwave lithotripsy ESWL. ESWL uses sound waves to create strong vibrations shockwaves, to break the stones into small pieces. Therefore, it can easily pass in urine. The procedure lasts about 45 to 60 minutes and can cause moderate pain. You may be under general anesthesia or anesthetized to make you comfortable. ESWL can cause blood in the urine, bruises on the back or abdomen, bleeding around the kidneys and other nearby organs, and in particular, discomfort when the stones pass through the urinary tract. Surgery to remove very large stones in the kidney. Percutaneous nephrolithotomy involves surgically removing a kidney stone using small telescopes. The tools insert through a small incision in your back. You will be under general anesthetic during the procedure until you recover. Use a scope to remove stones. To remove a smaller stone in your ureter or kidney, your doctor may insert a thin light tube ureter. This thin light tube has been equipped with a camera through the urethra and bladder to your ureter. After the stone is located, special tools can trap the rock or break it into small pieces. From there, it will easily pass through your urine. The doctor may then put a small tube stent in the ureter to reduce swelling and promote healing. You may need general or local anesthesia during this procedure. Parathyroid surgery. Some calcium phosphate stones are caused by overactive parathyroid glands. It is located at the four corners of your thyroid, just below your Adam's apple. When these glands produce too much parathyroid hormone, hyperparathyroidism, your calcium level may become too high and as a result kidney stones may form. Hyperparathyroidism sometimes occurs when a small, benign tumor forms in one of your parathyroid glands. Or you develop another condition, causes these glands to produce more parathyroid hormone. Eliminating the growth from the gland prevents the formation of kidney stones. Or your doctor may suggest treating a condition, causes your parathyroid glands to overproduce hormones. Best treatment for kidney stones at home. Try now, report kidney stone removal. Imagine your kidney stones gone pain-free, in just a few short hours from right now. Imagine yourself calling your doctor to cancel your scheduled surgery. Link in the description. Thank for watching. Good health.